If they're all working to Dark Souls 2, so last time we completed the rest of Huntsman's Gopes, Corpse, whatever the hell you want to call it, and we took out the boss, the Skeleton Lords. Frankly, we spanked him. But uh, we also arrived in Harvest Valley. Now, very quickly, before we go through the valley, we want to go back to the Forest of Fallen Giants, speak to the merchant here, and apparently if we exhaust her dialogue, she'll move to Medulla and we can buy some new stuff. You again? <laughs> It's shocking. Absolutely shocking. My name is Melentia. You're a stranger to this land. Oh, we get as strangers these days. Everybody's gonna run off. Maybe your creepy laughing scared them away. Drang Lake's been a pile of rubble since the war thought long, long ago. When the giants crossed the sea. Go on. Seemed like the battles would never end. Poor folk like myself had nary a place to sleep. I swear I keep all me things right with me. You may travel night, but me thinks you bear a burden of your own. <laughs> yeah, a curse or something. Who knows what that shit's about? They say these trees grew from the remains of the giants. From each carcass sprouted new life growing into what you see now. But you know what they all say, say? Don't believe what an old hag says. <laughs> it's high time that I pick up a move. Bingo! Up a bargain for you. Next time we meet my lover. It's not sex, is it? I, I, I don't want it. It's high Fantastic. Lovely times, these are. <laughs> okay, so yeah, apparently now she's gonna move to Medulla. She should have some new things and also unlimited light gems, because she only had 10 here. You may remember when I was getting my ass kicked by the Royal Rat Vanguard repeatedly, I came back to her and bought the 10 light gems that she had. Had we just moved her to Medulla, I could have bought unlimited ones, but hey, it was kind of fun getting my ass kicked. Well, Sort of, it was also really frustrating, but uh, I'm gonna run around see if I can find any other NPCs to move to Medulla, and depending on if we've done all of them, because I think we may have right now, but uh, I'm gonna double check, see if I can find any other ones, and I'll bring it back in if I do, or if we just, you know, we're ready to move on. Okay, I spoke to the Blue Sentinel fellow back at the Cathedral of the Blue, and he's still telling me to piss off, because frankly he's a dick. Also spoke to a uh, midget guy over there, he doesn't seem to want to move either, so uh... Unless I'm missing someone, which I probably am, that's all we can move for now, at least I think so. Right, do we Bear have any more shots? Yes, 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 yes. Curse King Souls, we get it. No, we don't. Well, alright then. Screw you. We do have some souls, but hey... Oh, okay, we don't have any, uh, any bone dust either. Right, so here's the question. Where the hell is Melentia? Is that her over there? Yes, you look like a pile of crap. Oh, you again? It's on the cheap for you. What's on the cheap for me? <laughs> Creepy! Seriously, darling, if you're offering me your body, I don't want it. It's I'm flattered, but honestly, I have no interest. Oh, there you go! Unlimited life gems, and she's got ten radiant ones as well, and some extra crap that I don't think she had before, but, uh... Yeah, that would have been handy, but hey, shit happens. At least we got her here now. Everyone's so stingy around here. Everyone's so stingy everywhere. You're not wrong. You're my only customer. Don't make me beg. Now buy something. Too late. That sounds like begging to me. Lowly time. I'm sorry. I don't need anything. I feel like a dick. Okay, so where the hell's the stone trader? Because it sounded like she was going to move to Medulla as well, but uh, I don't see her. Let's be honest here. She could be anywhere. This place is freaking humongous. And that other chick, the... Uh, the miracle check, she's down like by the entrance to the Hyde's Tower. Hyde's Tower. Heidi, Hyde, Heed. I don't know how the hell he's saying. You know what I'm talking about though, so uh Yeah, she could be literally anywhere. Is she like shacked up with this guy in here or something? Hello? Don't look like it. Where the hell are you? She's like a giant golden arrow, like an MMO or something. But uh are you are you like hidden in a corner? No. Where the hell is she? Oh she's there! How the hell did I miss that? God damn it! Oh, right past her. Oh, fancy meeting you here. Yeah, it took long enough. Speak up if you need anything at all, alright? 
I need lots of things. The question is, are you even going to have them? Do you actually have some stones now? Now, how the... I thought you were a stone trader. You suck. These stones may look... Yeah, yeah, you said it all before. But yeah, I know there are no stones interest. to enchant gear, but she doesn't seem to have any, even though you'd think she huh. would. But hey, whatever. How goes your journey? Take these. They should help a bit. Nay, I guess we spent enough souls with Lenny. What do we... We get his hammer? Well, alright then. You'll need souls to repair. I know only of... Don't waste your souls on you. Okay, apparently he's got nothing new to say. Is he selling some new gear? No, but he does have a repair powder, and holy shit, that's expensive. But I guess we should buy it since, you know, we don't have any. It's really handy, but, uh... Yeah, there's probably a merchant that sells unlimited, but, you know, I haven't found the damn guy, right. so, uh... Yeah, right now, we need all we can get our hands on, because apparently nothing lasts for five minutes in this damn game. It's insane. Anyway, we are just about ready to go back to the Harvest Valley. However, before we do Secret that, let's spend our souls. Question is, what do we want to get? Don't really know, and we should probably use our soul consumables. Yeah, okay, well, give me a moment here to use all our crappy souls up. I won't use any of the boss souls. And then we'll see what we can get. Okay, that's all the souls we have there. for now. 85 freaking Let's thousand. Now, I'm kind of torn between getting vitality for more equipment burden and endurance because we just need more stamina. Our stamina bar sucks ass. Also, it's weird to me, still, that vitality is equipment burden. That makes no sense. Vitality surely is your HP or something. I don't know, man. It's just weird. I realize this translates from Japanese, but like, god damn. But anyway, we're going to get endurance, I think, because even though it makes almost no difference, you never know. That little tiny bit more stamina might mean I can roll an extra time or block an extra attack or something, which could mean the difference between life and death. It also might mean jack shit, but that remains to be seen. Anyway, back to the Harvest Valley, which I fully expect to be poisonous as shit. Now, I don't necessarily know that the giant green toxic looking clouds are going to be poisonous, but... It seems likely, especially given there's poison shit right outside the bonfire, so... Yeah, looks like there's two poison areas in this game, which, uh... That's really gonna suck. Really, really gonna suck. Speaking of which, how much moss do we have? I think we have quite a decent amount. Yeah, 12. There's also an item called, uh... Something fruit, like common fruit or something, I think it's... Where the hell is it? Yeah, that thing, we got one. Yeah, it's, uh... Temporary slows down the buildup of poison or something, so... We'll pop that damn thing, you never know, it might make a huge difference. Also, might not do a damn thing, but, uh, yeah, it's, uh, looks poisonous to me. I don't know what's up with this big fella, but he looks pretty damn dangerous. Hey, you have a lot of HP, sir. Bullshit! What the hell was that? That did so much damage! Okay! <laughs> We're gonna chug off friggin' Estus. Don't shoot me again. I was not expecting that. That did not look like he was casting a spell to me. Well, I heard it! Okay, I don't know if they have an area of effect or something, they smash off a wall, but, uh, yeah, we killed the guy. Was there a little fella right in his back? I've got a smooth and silky stone. Give us, give us smooth. <laughs> Fuck you, crows. Where's our skeleton down here? I, you know what? I'm never going to question it. I don't know and I don't care. Give me that loot. Am I still going to get poisoned here? Eh, in fact, no, I'm not. Okay. Do we want to wait here for ages? Not particularly, no, so screw it, let's just go. But yeah, there's a lot of loot down here, so, uh... Yeah, the big fellas, it seems like it's best to just sort of run around behind them because they seem very, very slow. But from the front, very, very dangerous. I don't know what the hell a fading soul is. I don't think we've had one of those before. Maybe we have, I don't really remember. They're everywhere, apparently. They sound like really crappy souls to me. And we got another small and silky, smooth and stone and whatever the hell it's called. And another one. Holy shit, I guess we're paying another visit to the crows, even though those things drive me insane. Like, absolutely insane. Anyway, I don't really want to go in that poisonous looking hole down there. Are we out of the poison now? Yes, we are. Fantastic. There's another ghosty fellow there. What the hell are you doing? A torch? Really? Why are there random torches everywhere? I don't know and I don't... Oh, okay. It's running like a windmill looking place. And there's, uh... There's two other big fellas. Well, <laughs> shit. See, I don't know if we can shoot them from a distance. Oh, we have no bolts, apparently. Nope, we're out. God damn it. So I don't know if they're going to shoot me back. It seems kind of likely, but you never know. Maybe they have to got crappy AI and they won't give a shit, but uh, we're going to give it a go, but I am ready ready to run away and heal if I need to. Duh. Yep, yep, he's shooting me back. Okay, time to run. Time, time, time to run. Okay. Yeah. Don't want to get hit by that shit. I cannot believe how much damage that did. This, uh, this, this might take quite some time. 
We're just gonna have to run in and melee this guy, aren't we? And uh, the other guy's definitely gonna get alerted, so yeah. Or maybe he won't. Well, in fact, yeah, he probably is, but he's probably somewhere dragging this guy. Oh, jeez. Apparently he can punch. In fact, no, he's not alert, is he? Dan, you have a small field of view. Well, wonder I'll take it. I was gonna say he's probably somewhere dragging the guy out so that other fella can't see you. Apparently not half as hard as I thought it was gonna be. Now it's your turn, you big son of a bitch. Don't hit me with that shit. And yes, I see you up there, whatever the hell you're doing, you hollow bastards. No, 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 no. You get out of here. Okay, I'm watching the other fellas. Is that guy mining? This is not the time to be mining, sir. We got another smooth and silky stone, holy shit. In fact, that actually makes a certain amount of sense. Duh! Really, I missed? Wow, I suck. But, uh, yeah, I guess if they are mining, it makes kind of sense that you get uh, the stones around here because they're kind of like gems. Well, I guess they're more like poles. How do I get in there? I don't know. I really don't know. This fella's coming for me, though. Really? That missed you? Come on, buddy. C come down here. I want to jump attack you. Oh, you dick. You absolute dick. But yeah, anyway, I was gonna say, it makes sense that they would, you know, drop stones around here if they're mining in this place. Plus, if the clan people from the first game are in this, it would also make sense that they drop them. I don't know if they are, but, uh, that'd be kinda cool. I have literally no idea where I'm going, by the way. Looks like we found a dead end, though, and we got some hexing urns. I don't know what the hell they are. I assume dark magic, maybe? Because there's, like, lightning urns and magic and all that kind of crap. Don't really know. Maybe you can, in fact, no. I was gonna say, maybe you could stand up there and chuck them at the big fellas. Maybe you can, but, uh, look there, they were shooting dark magic, so maybe they're resistant to it. Don't really know. Ah, oh, it's a lever. I thought it was a gravestone for a second there. I'm guessing this is gonna raise the gates. Sounds like it. Fan freaking testic. Looks like we're not missing anything else around here. So let's go down here and see what awaits us. Probably death, I imagine, and poison, which is always lovely. Oh, right, it's down here. Ah, oh, a bonfire. Holy shit. This is what I'm saying, man, the bonfires are so damn close to each other, like, what did we do, really, between the last bonfire and this one? Three of the big fellas and a couple of little, you know, undead guys, which, it looked honestly like we probably could have just ran past the big fellas. Maybe they could have shot me up there, don't really know whilst I was opening the gate, but I would doubt it. But yeah, pretty cool area so far, like the uh, whole windmill, whoa, okay. Like the whole windmill thing going on like that, and uh, you know, there's like poison flowing everywhere and giant fellas being ridden. Not in the sexual way, by the way, but, uh, yeah, it's a cool-looking area so far. I'm interested to know the lore behind it, because the fact that there's poison everywhere and there's, like, giant dark shooting fellas that are being ridden around, it's very strange and kind of intriguing. And there's someone there whose name is filtered, apparently. I, I could probably guess what that is. There's more of these guys. I'm wondering, can we target the fellas on top? You maybe can, but I can't do it manually. Can I, can I do it like this? Careful. Careful. Let's go for his head. Die, you son of a bitch! Now, yeah, okay, that answers that question, you just hit the big guy. See, that would be kinda cool, like, if you could snap the little fella off the top and then maybe the big guy, I don't know, oh god! Maybe the big guy couldn't control himself anymore or something, I don't really know, but, uh, that would be awesome. No oh god! It's like a little smell! <laughs> it's like a little smell without his armor on. And now he's a little dead smell. Okay, there's another giant poison pit down there with loot and big fellas. I don't, there's blood everywhere, holy shit. I don't really know that we want to go down there, but there's bound to be loot down there, so, you yeah, know, we probably should, but for now, we're gonna keep going this direction, because it looks safer to me. Which looks like we're probably supposed to go. Did you just poison yourself? I think you did. So there's Olga, so it's poison those pots. But you're not taking poison damage, so I'm guessing you're immune to it, which, frankly, that's kind of dickish. Either way, they are dead. Is there any more around here? I don't see any. Okay, so what's going on down? Oh, shit. Is that deep water? Like, am I going to drown in that, or is that just poisonous? It's definitely at least poisonous. It looks deep to me. I want to go on that. Okay, I'm trying to see if I can see the edge. Okay, we can stand here. Yeah, that's deep. I'm not going in there. I'm not I'm not doing it. That, that I'm going to drown in there. And now we're poisoned. Great, but I see loot. Nothing attacked me from the side. I'm watching you. Okay. But, uh, yeah, what a way to go, like, drowning in poison. Bad enough to drown, but in poison? Like, holy shit. That's some... F oh, God, what's going on here? Oh, great, there's, like, a, a poison shooting fella next to me. Do you mind, sir? I'm trying to get my freaking Estus ready. Ugh. Yeah, poke attack of justice. Oh, great, the shroomy people are everywhere. I remember these from, uh, I think it was... What was the name? The gutter where we found the giant weird ant that doesn't do anything? Yeah, there were the little weird mushroom people around her, him. I'm going to her, because it was like a giant queen ant or something. Maybe it was a dude, 
I don't really know. I didn't see a schlong, so I'm going to go with the assumption that it was probably a female. Right, so use the first lockstone here. Don't know what the hell this is going to do, but screw it, we're trying anyway. Okay, it looks like the illusory wall crane kind. Yes, yes it is. Please don't be a tramp. I'm watching you. You better not be a mimic, I swear to God. Doesn't look like it. Okay. What do we get? Poisoned by a ring and a soul of a prayer knight. I guess it makes a certain amount of sense. We should probably equip that bad boy. Why am I wearing the, uh... The, uh... What the hell is it called? This thing. Why am I wearing that? So I get invaded more. It's not even working. Nobody invades me ever. Pointless. Absolutely pointless. I cannot find this freaking ring. There you are. Nope. There we go. Okay, so... I don't know how much that increases our poison resistance, but I'm guessing quite a bit, so... Yeah, we're gonna go with that. It looks like we... Yes, we actually made it out of here without getting poisoned. I really should check in there, but I feel like that's deep water. It's gotta be deep, surely. I, I really wanna check, but... I also don't wanna die. I mean, can you blame me? I've died enough, for Christ's sakes. I've <laughs> died enough for one playthrough. And we ain't even finished yet. I don't think we're close, but... Uh, well, maybe we're close. We got, like, three souls. One to go, and then, you know, apparently the Shrogard. The Shrine of Winter, which I'm told is halfway point in the game, but I very much doubt that, but the game we shall see. Why am I still being poisoned? I'm not in the, uh... I'm not in the green... I just got... What's going on? What was up with that shit? I wasn't in the green stuff anymore, is... Yeah, apparently your poison goes up just being near the pots. Well, that sucks. There's another guy with a forward name. What the hell is with you people? Okay, so it looks like there's a platform there that we can jump to. Or, well, in fact, you can it looks like you can probably jump to it, but maybe you don't have to. Maybe that's just a trap, and maybe you can sort of end up around behind it somehow. There's loot in there. How do we get there? I don't know. Can we run and jump sideways? Don't look like it. But, uh, yeah, maybe there's another entrance in there, and that's just for an exit or something. Don't really know, but let's kill this little small fella. Duh! Yeah, take that. I'm assuming these guys hit very hard, because they don't have much HP, and that's kind of a theme jump attack. Yeah, get out of my sight. And he dropped something as well. Okay, apparently if you want shards, these dudes drop them all of the time. Again, I guess that makes a certain amount of sense, because... You know the ore trader sells them, so I guess they're kind of considered stone, so... If this is like a mining quarry or something, it makes a certain amount of sense, kind of. I thought they looked more like blacksmiths, but, uh... That kind of remains to be seen. And there's more mushroom people. God damn it, I hate mushrooms in every way, shape, and form. Oh god, there's another guy behind me. Yoink. See ya, jerk ass. <laughs> yeah, probably swing very, very slowly, so, uh, yeah, again, it's kind of making me think that guy could probably kill me in one hit, so... Don't want that to happen. I'm gonna get poisoned. You dick. You mushroom dick. God, I hate poison. We are running out of moss already, and we got another smooth and silky stone. Holy shit. And a chest that has blood in front of it. Well, this, uh, how did you die? I, I don't know. It looks like maybe you got attacked by an NPC or something? Well, it's not a mimic, so fuck it, it's open a damn thing. Oh, great, it's poison, go! Okay, for once we actually didn't get poisoned. Right, what do we get? Give me good loot. A torch. One torch in a chest that has a trap. Screw you, Frost, oh, seriously. What the hell is that shit? Anyway, it looks like this is the way you get down to this loot here, yes. Be something good. Skeptic Spice. Well, it's good, but not for this character, but hey, at least we got it. I really want to go in the deep water. I... Okay, here's the plan. We gotta try and jump to this edge. If we make it, great. If we don't, we land in the water, and we know whether it's deep or not, so... Screw it, let's go for it. Careful, and... Bonsai! Okay... No, 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 no. No! <laughs> Well, shit. Okay, so, uh, kind of made it. Might have panicked and rolled off the edge in the other direction to try and save myself, but hey, myth busted. We know it's deep water. Damn it. <laughs> Damn it, didn't see that hole there. Well, shit, I guess we're gonna check down here first before we go back, but, uh, yeah, I, I can't see shit, Captain. And we're poisoned now. I... I don't know where we're going. There could just be a pitfall in here that I walk straight into and die. There could also be enemies in here that I can't see that will kill me. I... I don't know where I'm going. I'm gonna die down here. <laughs> I'm pretty damn sure I don't have any freaking home with bones. No. No, I don't. Oh, this sucks. So much ass. Well, we're not poisoned now. We've at least got some moss, so we stand a chance of getting out of here, but, uh... I... I seriously... Okay, we found something. 
We're back where we started. That's not. It's, it's not something. <laughs> where do I go? I. Hey, we found. Okay. It looks like we may have found the way out. We actually have. Holy shit! And it's out here. Okay, so we survived it. And there's, uh, there's another archway over there, which I'm kind of tempted to check out. But uh, you know, I've learned my lesson for now. We should probably at least go back and get my souls. That's the wrong way. Retrieved. <laughs> okay, we made it back alive. Now, I noticed there was an archway over here, which we haven't actually been down, so we'll get to check over here, and we are not going to try and jump to that ledge again, even though I made it. So it's not that hard of a jump, but, uh, yeah. And apparently this is right back at the freaking start. But that was entirely pointless, but still, once we're down here, we may as well kill these guys, otherwise they're going to chase me down and kill me, but, uh, yeah, this is definitely where we came from. Did we even... Yeah, we went this way. Uh, I really want to go down there and get the loot. I really shouldn't be doing this. We did get our souls back, though, so, you know, that's something. I can't believe that actually hit him. That was amazing. Okay, no, 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 no. Oh, God, the other guy's shooting. The other guy's shooting. Ouch! Okay. <laughs> Down to retreat and heal, and uh, we're getting poisoned here. God damn, this place is dangerous. Okay, take the fruits. Eat the pudding, eat the pudding, eat the pudding. Okay. Now you mind, you son of a bitch. If we can just kill one of them. That's right, perfect. Now, we should have enough of an opening here, because they take a long time to shoot that we can take this guy out like that, and then run the balls away before that hits us. Perfect. Now you're mine. Oh my god, you are gonna get it. And we got some, I don't even know what the hell we got there, I wasn't paying attention. Prepare to die. Oh, she's swinging. Da, 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 da. Yeah, that would probably one-shot me from this HP. Okay, the big fella's down, and we got the loot. Fan freaking testing Again, there's an archway over here that we haven't been down, so screw it, we're gonna check it, but, uh... Okay, it looks like it's just a dead end. Thank you, I am very glad about that. I thought it was gonna be, like, another twisting pathway of blindness, so, uh... Yeah, it looks like we've got everything around here. We're probably missing something. I remember there was, uh... Some loot on a ledge all the way back past the first bonfire, or I guess the, uh... The second one, technically. And we still haven't got that yet, so we're missing something, but for now... We're just gonna carry on, and we can always come back. Okay, turn away into the fog and see what the hell is going on around here. I'm assuming this is going to be a boss, because there was a whole bunch of summon signs here last time. Of course, I can't see them now, because I'm not human, but, uh, yeah, the covetous demon. Is that Jabba the Hutt? Die, Jabba. Holy shit, Jabba ain't got much HP. I'm guessing he really, really, oh yeah, I'm guessing he really, really hurts. And with a name like the covetous demon, he can probably eat me, so. Don't want that shit. Am I really going to kill him this quickly? Holy shit, it's dead. You, sir, are the worst boss in the entire Soul series. You're worse than Pinwheel, at least he was cool. What a jab of the heart wannabe knockoff loser son of a bitch. What a joke. What an absolute joke. Okay, we beat a boss in like 10 seconds, literally. And we found a bonfire. And there's a... Uh, Luca Deal, I think our name is? Hey, baby, how's it going? What's out here? Death. Bollocks thing is blood everywhere. Oh, crap. Okay, jam pits of doom with uh, apparently poison at the bottom. Yeah, don't want to do that. And yes, I know we need to go speak to Luke Till. We're doing that in a second. I just want to quickly see what we're dealing with up here before we go back to her and you know spend our souls and everything else. I just want to see. And apparently there are uh, weird headless fellas. Well, all right then. We we'll got some loot over there. Oh god, and there's a small fella behind the giant pot of doom. I'm guessing that pot is uh. Yeah, it looks like it's poison in it, so we probably don't want to break that, so we're not going to. What do we get? Radiant Life Gem. Nice. Okay, before we go back and speak to Lucatiel, there was uh, a staircase past the cover of this demon. Now, I'm guessing you can't actually go up there, but I want to try just in case. We'll be back, baby. Just wait there. But yeah, there was a broken off staircase in here. Now, like I say, I'm guessing you can't actually go up here, but there are messages, so... Maybe you can, maybe you can't, I really don't know. It looks like, yeah, you can at least jump on here. Now, can we make it over this edge is the question. I jump, you son of a bit. Or, you know, you can fall off. God, I'm, I'm gonna get up here. I don't, oh my god. Yeah, looks like it's an invisible wall there. That means you can't even jump, so. Apparently not. But hey, at least we tried, just in case. But once I actually explored something. Okay, it's rest because I forgot to do it last time. And then we'll see what Lucatiel has to say. What's up, baby? Did you miss me? Still on the road, are you? Sorry to have burdened you so. This is for you, by way of an apology. I don't know what you're apologizing for, but thanks. I found my thoughts growing hazy. My memories are fading, 
oldest first. The curse is doing its work upon me. I am frightened. Terribly so. If everything should fade, what will be left of me? Yo, so she's turning hollow, I guess. I had an older brother. We learned to fence together. He became the most decorated swordsman in all of Mirror. I never even compared to him. Nothing compares in fact, I to never you. Him. Not once. But then, one day, he was gone. Lost without a trace. Now I'm certain that he was taken by the curse. If only someone would hear my tale. I just did. My brother must have come here, too. Soon I may forget even about him. If only someone... My okay, apparently that's what she has to say. So yeah, it sounds like she's turning hollow when she starts to lose her memories and stuff like that. I don't really know, but she did show us her face uh, when we spoke to her back in the Lost Bastille. She took off her mask. And she's all like green and stuff, so uh, yeah, I assume that's what she's talking about. Where the hill is the Emerald Herald? What are you doing? Is that a shard to see light? However, is that a shard? I'd see light. However, I fade king souls. Seek, seek. Yes. Quite so. Okay, we reinforced our Estus Flask. Do we have any more? I don't think so. No, but it was worth a check. Right, let's spend our souls this time. Maybe we should go for vitality since we spent on endurance last time. But uh, yeah, yeah, let's do it. Why the hell not? Because we still are kind of crappy on the equipment button front. Anyway, I'm going to end it here next time we explore the rest of wherever the hell we are. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, I'd appreciate a like. And I will see you next time for more Dark Souls 2.